Using prompts and generative AI to bring your vision to life is an incredible skill to have at your disposal. But sometimes, there are things that you want to convey in an image that you just can't quite fully put into words. In this lesson, we'll take a look at how you can use reference images to extend the creative possibilities available with generative AI. We'll explore how you can use reference images to update the style and composition of your designs. Imagine you have an original artwork you've created, and you know the style and colorway would map beautifully to a digital series you're working on. Or you've been trying to get the placement of a product just right, and you have a similar image on hand that's laid out perfectly. This is where reference images come in. They enable you to enhance your text prompts by providing the generative AI with a visual reference to a particular style or composition that you'd like to incorporate in your design. There are two ways to use reference images in your projects. This includes style reference images and composition reference images. A style reference image helps you keep a consistent look and feel across your designs. By using a reference image, you can match the style of your generated images to the style of your reference image. This means you can ensure that your generated images have the specific color, texture, lighting, and stylistic elements that you're looking for. With a composition reference image, you can generate images that match a specific layout and structure that you have in mind in terms of how the elements are laid out and organized in the image frame. This can help open many possibilities, such as how a subject is posed in your design, how objects are arranged for an advertisement, the way that a given element meanders through a scene you're creating. Composition reference images help you get the layout and depth of many different elements just right. Reference images help take your generative AI creation to the next level by giving you an unprecedented amount of creative control. Imagine you're tasked with creating a series of images for a mountain resort. They've provided you with their style guide, which includes image composition and graphical style. They'd like a design that features the natural landscape of the area, including mountains, alpine forests, and a chalet-style hotel. Their style guide shows that their brand images follow a more animated 3D style than photorealistic. You can use your client's existing image as your style reference image, along with an original text prompt to generate a new design that matches the look, feel, and colorway that they're looking for. Now, the Mountain Resort client also provided a second reference image of a winding river that runs through the mountains. Again, this is something that you could experiment with text prompts or manual edits to try to match. But with the composition reference image feature, you can quickly match the layout that they're looking for. By adding the river reference image under composition, you can generate multiple variations of the original design to meet all of the style and composition requirements. There are so many useful ways that you can take advantage of reference images in your projects. Graphic designers can use style reference to guide the design of logos and branding materials. Content creators can create visual content for social posts and articles that maintain consistent visual styles and themes. Fashion designers have new opportunities to experiment with different trends, patterns, and styles in their designs. And product designers can quickly produce realistic prototype designs that match preferred color schemes and product aesthetics. With reference images, you can have even more control over the style and composition of your designs. Now it's time to go give it a try.